try to keep up. Check out that body count! Prospective patient, I sense why Sparling Grouse sent you, and I can help. But first, are you in a consciousness center place and prepared for growth? Um, yeah. Ah, but is your energy properly aligned? Let me observe your energy flow for a moment. Sure. I'm sensing that you have a very stressful work environment and that you feel the fate of the universe rests on your shoulders. Interesting. Now I see your energy is flowing. Keep aligning. This is stupid. Slightly more to the left. Will you just open the door? There we are. You are now properly aligned, healing. Please, enter my sanctum. Remember, this is a sanctified space where all life forms can coexist harmoniously. Sure, whatever. Your first diagnostic session is free. After that, I charge a nominal fee of $1,000 per cosmic realignment. Now, to begin, please lie on the couch. Um... I can't do that. As you wish. Path will take you where it must. Anyway, we'll move on. Now I'd like you to express yourself creatively. It exfoliates the soul. Use that paint there and just nuts on the canvas. Excellent. Now paint whatever is in your heart. Your soul's heart. Ha! 
Since you feel stuck in an endless loop of violence and material acquisition. Interesting. I know just the thing to break your cycle. A magnificent gift, just for you. Please, open the box of tranquility for a glorious reward in recognition of all your hard work today. Not what you were expecting? And how did that make you feel? It made me feel like you're an asshole. Yes, yes! You're expressing yourself! It's time to start your treatment. Listen carefully. You must trust me completely for the treatment to work. Under no circumstances should you resort to violence. I don't know. I want to be crystal clear. We cannot walk the path to healing hand in hand with barriers between us. I will let down my guard, and so must you. Do not shoot me. I cannot stress that enough. You do not resort to violence. This is for your own good. Stay right there. I need you to trust me. You have to trust me. Do not. Never achieve harmony acting like that. You're a terrible patient! My senses indicate you got the memory core. Good work. Come on back. How'd it go, buddy? Didn't you feel the signal burst? They killed Turner's how it went. Why would they do that? Because he's quite annoying. Or was. Crystals are good for is high precision internal timekeeping. And some are quite gritty. Why are you so mean, Grouse? This was a matter of survival, Sparrow. When are you going to start taking things seriously? Never. What's the point of life if you have to take everything seriously all the time? You're hopeless. Surely you felt the necroquakes, Vault Hunter. It must be Mallow ones to me. Right. Quake time, best time! As you can see, Sparrow finds the necroquakes fun and cool. But if they continue, this planet will be torn apart and everything will perish. Which is objectively not cool. You must use those beacons to discover the source of the quakes. <sighs> Vault Hunter! Time to see what this machine can do! Go ahead, put in the last vault key. Huh? <laughs> 
take some explosives as well, just in case. And to start, place the first beacon. Good. Now just two more. We must triangulate the beacons to determine the necro
additional frequency, meaning instead of being torn asunder by voracious animals, you've placed the other beacon. Good. Now I will triangulate. One moment. Gross! You're on fire! Look! Gross! Hey! Please, Sparrow, I'm trying to concentrate. Okay, sending you coordinates, Salt Hunter. Interesting. The necroquakes are coming from a subterranean abscess or cave in common parlance. We will create an opening with the explosives. Hold it. Proceed underground and find the source of those quakes. Surely the necro quakes are mellow ones doing. But their time will come. Then we will exterminate this planet's fauna one by one and finally all will be quiet. That sort of sounded like you want to kill every living thing on the planet but us. Yes, it did sound like that, Sparrow. Like that.
I do? Quakes have stopped. Thank you, Vault Hunter. Our survival is assured. For now. <clears throat> you ready to rock? I've stuck on this rock with a grumpy Gus who shall remain nameless. So I want a new robot friend. To build one, we're gonna need some parts. Go borrow some of Malawan's stuff.
suppose we could use an extra pair of hands since Sparrow barely carries his weight around here. Hey, not nice. Besides, I'm here for moral support. Well, Typhon put me in charge of security, and I say we need a combat bot to protect us. <laughs> One with heavy armor to deflect our enemies. Combat bot. We need a cool friend who can fly around and do sweet tricks. Maneuverability is key for battle as well. Let's use Oversphere Death Lasers instead. Pew, pew, baby. 
Find a damn AI chip on my own.
set up over here. Install those parts you got. Slap them in there, Vault Hunter. Ha! Get our new friend up and running in no time. Friend? I think so. Just like, automatically. Wow. Dude. Now, flip on the power. that this horrid creation requires a mercy killing. Kill me! I can't feel my anything! I can't Take anything seriously, and you probably messed up the brain somehow. Thank you. Well, that didn't go super great, but what matters is we tried. Yes, tried and failed. Thank you for trying to help. Even if it was a colossal failure, which it was. At least we didn't get destroyed by our own creation. Wouldn't that have been tragic? Between the vaults makes sense. The vaults on Promethea and Eden 6 must be the power sources for this machine. Intriguing. Wow, 
You're smart. Bit of an understatement, don't you think? Ha! And you know who you are. That's a rare thing in this universe. A dream come true. We must focus. The first step is to locate the machine's control console. Cool place. The Meridians never did anything small, did they? Oh, I guess you do need a planet-sized machine to seal up an entire planet. No refund. Owen. Oh, you're too kind. No, seriously! Fascinating. Perhaps Sirens had some hand in constructing this machine. You know what? You remind me of Leda. Catch me, Bolt Hunter. I swoon. If only I had a decade to study this machine. Its design is mind-gasmingly complex. But I do believe its primary operation to be fairly straightforward. To start, I require the Pandora Vault Key. I never told my daughter about this place, but stay sharp. If I know the Iridians, there's sure to be some guardians around here. Guardians! Let's take them out together!
one of the statues your scientist was talking about. Give us the key, like an offering. The Promethea Vault has been activated. This way, Vault. Hunter, next up, Eden Six. Paradise my hairy ass, but it does have its charms. Went skinny dipping in a Saurian top hit once. I was hairless for a month. says to reveal the steps. Guess it means use that switch. <laughs> Whoa, it's quite a schlep. Guess the Meridians didn't mind a little exercise, huh? Good thing I've got the whip. See you up top. This way! Come on!
that I killed them. A billion lives to power a machine. Should it comfort me that they will thrum in its heart forever? Perhaps oblivion would have been kinder. It would have been for me, at least. Holy baloney! Would you look at that? This way! Come on! Like the last one! The machine nearly has enough power to seal Pandora! Keep going! Last one, Vault Hunter! This way! Stay sharp! <clears throat> this way! Come on!
you off of the key. Better hold on to your keys to... Told ya! All of the connections to the vault are activated. Return to me, fair Typhon. Vault Hunter, you may come to. Lilith, you might want to come down and see this. On our way. <clears throat> Tannis, is it working? Tannis! Whoa. but it hasn't activated yet. Pandora is still opening. Maybe it needs a siren's touch. Oh, touch it I shall. As the Nihilus said on his deathbed, here goes nothing. <laughs> I understand. 
left hand now. Holy baloney! Would you look at that? Tannis, you all right? Yes! So much power! And I am the conduit! Pandora's closing! All right! It's working! Yeah, I'm gonna have to put a stop to that. COV incoming! Ava, keep them off Tannis! On it. This is it. You know what to do, Kill. I'm with you, Bob Hunter! End of the road, superfan! Anyway... When Troy and I were kids, we'd stare up at the night sky and dream of becoming stars. Brightest in the galaxy, Troy always said. Starlight! Don't do this! So we left this place behind. And went to Pandora to become Vault Hunters ourselves. We'd open the Vault of Vaults and become the biggest stars in the galaxy. Irene, listen to me! This won't end the way you think it will! Trust me! They seem so small now, our dreams. Not befitting a god. Now I'm gonna devour every last star in the universe, one by one. Until nothing shines but me. and see how that turned out? You scared old man! This is your fault! You kept us here when the universe should have been ours! I gave you what I could. I don't care! I'm gonna take what's mine! Ah! I'm sorry, Starlight.
Typhon. You gotta stop her. It's too late for me. Just promise me something. Don't be the last Vault Hunters. We won't. He's gone. The Andorra's gonna be ripped apart. And if Tyrene leeches the Destroyer, that'll be the least of our problems. We have to stop her. Typhon bought us our <gasps> lives, but we're running out of last chances. Lilith, I may have a shortcut to where Tyrene went. This machine works across interstellar distances. There must be a way... Yes, I can use the connection to Pandora to form a portal. Killer, we'd be dead a thousand times over if it wasn't for you. I've been telling myself I still belonged on the front lines, but a leader needs to know when to let a soldier do their job. This is your fight. It worked! It seems I can add time and space to the long list of things I have mastered. over. It's time. The Destroyer is escaping. You ready, killer? Just give the order, Commander. I'm ready. Okay. This ends on Pandora, one way or the other. Head through the portal and find Tyrene. We'll see you on the other side. Counting on you, killer. The destroyer is ripping the planet apart. You have to stop Tyrene. Pandora's always been a hellhole, but it's our hellhole, damn it. Even if Tyrene is stopped, Elphus is far too close to Pandora. The Great Vault will continue to open. Let's worry about that when Tyrene is dead. One apocalypse at a time. We're in orbit, VH. I got eyes on your fine ass from Sanctuary. Pandora's tearing itself a new one, but I ain't letting you fight that mega devil bitch alone. Mm, finally. Don't expect mercy, superfan. I'm not that kind of god.
Oh, man! 
She's gone. Well, would you look at that? Go on. Vault's all yours. gonna come back, is she? Well, she died and turned to ash, so I'm gonna give it a hard maybe. You got your powers back. Feels good, right? I spent so long without them, I'd almost gotten used to it. I'm not gonna lie, it does feel good. over. Not entirely. Great Vault is still opening. Elpis is tearing Pandora apart. How do we stop it? Very simple. We can't. Not unless you know a way to remove the moon from the sky. Run towards the fire. The sanctuary's yours, Ava. Be ready. What does Lilith think she's doing? Closing the Great Vault. She's saving Pandora. That, that could kill her! She knows.
should go back up to Sanctuary. See if there's anything she left us. I assume you mean anything valuable to pilfer, but yes, let us investigate. Didn't take long for Marcus to ban me from his shop. Joke's on him, I took his padlock. Now I can't go in, and he can't leave. I could go for some Digby Vermouth. My favorite album is Neon Dreamsicle. Quarters, Vault Hunter. Please bring me the vault key you retrieved from Tyreen. Recruit, you did it! You followed my instructions exactly and saved Pandora! Alright, Ava wants to talk to you. She's in Lilith's room. You know what I like? Money. No, it's true. I just finished an excellent Echo Net series. Good show, Vault Hunter. Science is a slow thing. It must be chewed gradually, like a bone or several bones. waiting for us. She's just... gone. Maya, she used to tell me stories about Lilith and the 
two of them were fighting side by side. I miss them both. Lilith had her own secrets back here. This chest is of Iridian design, but I have no idea where she might have gotten it. There's no external mechanism on it, but perhaps I can phase shift it open. Ah, so I can. Peculiar. Lilith must have intended for me to find this, but that would mean... Nonetheless, there's another matter for us to discuss, Vault Hunter. My enormous intellect, I have sussed out the purpose of the artifact you discovered inside the vault. It is an advanced guardian mind core. I've created a neural adapter that will link it up with the ship's fast travel system. Please do so now. The guardians used that mind core to improve their own combat AI by training in simulations of alternate, more chaotic universes. At least I believe they were simulations. It's unclear, but don't be too concerned. Any paradoxes or reality leaks should either resolve themselves, or we will all be obliterated before we can feel too much pain. Sounds fun. And doesn't it? I call it Mayhem Mode. I've integrated it into our onboard fast travel map, so you can use it whenever you feel the call of mayhem. Enjoy. Yeah. 